Welcome back everyone for our second match today at the 2018 World Cup Uruguay against Russia third match day in Group A both teams sharing a point at the start of this match and um, both sides with disappointing campaigns until now uh, Russia of course has the host country didn't satisfy their uh, fans Uruguay on the other side just as disappointing considering the quality players that they have in the squad and it's now time for the national anthem Let's see how the two teams will uh, line up. Uruguay with Moslero in goal. Captain Godin, Jimenez, Caceres and Pereira playing in defence. Vecino, Bentacul, Axel and Sanchez in the midfield. Uh, Suarez and Cavani in attack. Russia, as always, captained by goalkeeper Hakim Fev. Kutipovno, Stado and Vasin in defence. Glushokov, Verokin, Zagor, Zirkov and Semedov in the midfield. Pauls and Golovin in attack. So we're ready for kickoff. Uruguay gets us on the way. And as I said in the previous uh, video, we're now in the final stretch of the group stage. Getting closer and closer to the knockout round where uh, things are starting to really get serious. A few countries left and um, all of them uh, taking part in the final 100 meter run towards the trophy. That's a great pass to Cavani and started doing well to defend. Rokin to Samirov. Polos receives. That's a good pass into Samirov. Oh, they're playing well across. Headed away by Benteco. Sino tried to pass it to Suarez. It's been cut off by the Russians. Now he intercepts for Uruguay. Suarez to Cavani. Nice control and the shot has been stopped by Akinfev. Goev getting a touch in there, but the ball didn't reach uh, one of his teammates. Max out. Cavani to Suarez. Across towards Cavani, headed away by Vassin, and Vassina with the shot uh, didn't hit it too well. Pereira to Sanchez, now Vassina again. Cavani to Pereira. Sanchez's cross is uh, blocked and it goes out for a corner kick for uh, Uruguay. Kadin taking the corner kick towards Sanchez. It's punched away. Axel gets the ball. Tried to pass it to Cavani. We almost got it back, but Russia now in possession. Polos chasing the ball, gets to it. Uh, Caceres is getting in front of him and gets the ball for his side. Sanchez playing a long pass to Cavani, headed away. Zirkov, Zagoev, back to Zirkov. Golovin, Glushakov passing it on the right to Samidov. Golovin taking the shot. Well saved by Moslera. Half an hour gone. No goal scored yet, but uh, both teams playing uh, well. Throwing now to Uruguay. Herrera. Nice 
Nice pass to Suarez. Pereira puts a cross. So it's Cavani. It's saved. And the second time hit the post, I think. Very close to scoring the first goal. And now a great pass for Polos. Russia could score right after that. Great chance. The shot is not very good. Unbelievable counter attack with only two passes. They got the ball to their striker, but he hasn't really done a good job at finishing that shot there. Goal kick now, Muslera. A long pass to Suarez. Hussein. Zagoev to Polos. Chips the ball on the left to Zirkov. Reaches the end of it. This pass is a go -ev. Across. That will be cleared away by Godin. Polos with another shot is deflected. And Godin tries to clear it away. And get away from danger for now. Golovin, a great pass to Polos. And that's a goal. Only three minutes left in the first half and they take the lead. Even if they will be out on the group stage, certainly they will want to end their journey at the World Cup with a win at least. Very well played passes again. It's in uh, their two attackers, look at this. Perfect one to So, Russia in the lead with a few minutes left in the first half, but uh, you must keep in mind that before this goal, Uruguay has had a huge chance where Cavani missed. The yellow card now shown to Rokin. Uh, Suarez, yeah, he's holding his face, he's been hit in the face. See this free kick. We try to get the ball in the box. So well defended by Russia. And another chance for an attack. Golovin with the ball. Looking for options. Tries to get it to Polos. Oh, that's not a very good clearance. He's back on the ball. And the shot is saved by Maslera. Great moments for uh, Russia. He stopped the ball, but it really wasn't a clearance, just stopped the ball. And Polos got right back on it, took the shot. It was safe fortunate for them by the goalkeeper, but now they have this corner kick. It's headed away by Jimenez. Ball gets back to Slamidov. Rokin passing it back to him. And now the cross towards Polos, heads it! And another save by Moslera, no time for another corner kick. It's the end of the first half. And Russia Lady got the break. We have returned for the second half of the match between Uruguay and Russia. The European side leading at the break and uh, playing very, very well, at least in the uh, final 15 minutes or so of the first half. Uruguay had their chances as well, but what they didn't do right was defending. That's why they can see the goal and we're very close to take another one. Maybe they'll fix their mistakes in the second half. No, they give the ball away to Polos and it's 2-0. What a great goal. And it's this player's brace. Fantastic shot. Look at that. Godin passed it well to Laxal, got the ball back, and the second time he gave it away. Right to his opponent, and 
What a great shot that was. No defender in front of him. Mastero with little to do there. It was one of those unstoppable shots. He doubled the advantage early into the second half and a comfortable lead now, but I'm not sure. But it might not be enough for Russia to finish uh, second. As you know, Egypt uh, leading the group with six points. Suarez across. Clear the ball away. And they get it once again to Polos. Looking to get a hat trick, is it? in, picks it out for, I think it's going to be a throw-in, not a corner kick, yes. Samedov, a long throw in the box, it's headed away, but the ball gets to Zagoev, Koshakov, Rokin, pass intercepted, and now Jimenez with the ball, trying to get up front, see, he doesn't really decide who to pass it to, it's Suarez, gets the ball to Cavani. Dispossessed. Russia defending very well, they have this two goal lead to defend. Intercepted ball by Bentaco. Messino to Laxalt. Bentaco again. Dispossessed by Zagoev. Passes to Samidov. Zagoev again. With the ball on the left to Zirkov, they haven't really attacked uh, too much from the left side. Polos, nice dribble, a pass to Golovin, could have passed it in the box, but I think wanted to make sure they keep the ball. So go ahead, dispossessed. And it's a long ball towards Suarez, but Hassan is there to get it and pass the goalkeeper. Godin, that's out, and a pass all the way back to the goalkeeper, they are out of ideas, Uruguay, I'm sure they did not expect um, Russia to score the goals the way they did, Messino, Zerkov with the first on the ball there of course, It's a foul. It's a free kick for you, boy. And the referee's right. Final 15 minutes. And after this match, we will see the final standings in Group A. And find out the first two teams to advance. Uh, round of 16 or rather 100% sure that they'll advance there are two other teams with six points in the other groups and now uh, yes that was indeed a foul a good chance for Uruguay from this free kick what it's awarded to Russia okay I cannot make sense of that certainly Video assistant refereeing would have been very helpful here. <laughs> and now the ball gets to Suarez. Can't pass it to Cavani. And Russia maintaining possession into the final 10 minutes. Polos, good control. The pass to Zirkov. The Rokin. Very good dribbling. Pass to Polos. Zirkov with a cross, so it's Golovin and the header is saved. Polos now. The pass towards the Rokin would have been good if the Rokin wasn't retreating already. Should have waited for uh, his teammates' pass. But anyway, now they get the ball back and another attack for Russia. Polos to Rokin. Smidov. Golovin trying to get Polos. Team heads away to Sanchez. No minute at it. Cavani with the ball. And that's the end of the match. 2 0 win for Russia. If they're out, as I said, at least they're ending it with a win.
Uruguay with a very, very disappointing run at the World Cup. They are out. But we will now have a look at the final standings in Group A. So Egypt finishing first with six points, two wins and one match loss to Saudi Arabia, who will finish second with five points and advance to the knockout stage. Russia finishing third with four points and Uruguay fourth with only one. The two big disappointments in this group, Russia of course being the host country and Uruguay, as I said, a team with a lot of quality players. They finish fourth very very disappointing for the fans but we now know the two teams that are through to the knockout round from group a we still have a few more undecided groups but group b is leaded but by spain as you know uh, looking as favorites in that one and again uh, the other three teams fighting for the second place and that is exactly the group we'll now move on to the final two matches in that group as well, Iran against Portugal and Spain against Morocco. Make sure to check out those matches. I will see you in those ones.